going on guys welcome back with another video so this is not going to be a gaming video today this is going to be a reaction vid somewhat getting hype on this new resident evil 4 remake game in the next month and i'm truly excited for it they're dropping a lot of you know clips screenshots a whole bunch of stuff we're getting closer to release day so you know they're going all out at the moment sometimes you know they're going with leaks they're going with you know exclusive gameplay it's been a lot me i've literally been up to date with all of them from from the very beginning really i think since like sometime last year or i'm still thinking that it's 2022 obviously i mean sometime in 2021 when i first got news of resident evil 4 remake was being you know in development or whatever that has been in development since like 2018 or something but now we finally have it we got our trailer in the middle of last year we got a trailer close towards the end of last year and also we got just gameplay recently we got we got some gameplay i believe like last week and then we got this new gameplay um pretty much it's chapter five but the way i see it i'm pretty sure it's not like chapter five five like the the last chapter in the original game because what they show on chapter five right here looks a lot earlier in the game so maybe they're might about to change like the chapter system really like on some uncharted stuff so you know like how every level is pretty much a, a chapter so pretty much i think they might go that route because in resident evil 4 yeah every level was a chapter too but like you know it will show like what the completed level was so it'll be like chapter 1.1 and 1.2 1.3 and then it goes to chapter 2 it starts at chapter 2.1 you know so i think they're just dropping that and just going to just go directly with like number chapters just going from one to however how much the chapters are going to be i'm thinking it might be like a good 15 to 20 chapters depending on you know what's in the game or whatever but let's get into this footage for real for real it's going to be a lot we're going to like go over a lot of footage getting literally hyped for it because you know i, I like played the original resident evil 4 on the channel basically just showing my skills and you know getting hyped for the remake and yeah we're doing a lot we're going all out for this game pretty much i was waiting for this game since the start of my channel and here we are two years later we're finally going to be playing this game so enough of all this talking let, let me let me get into this footage right quick i actually had to do the absolute most I was trying to, I, cause I actually don't know how to like, you know, do all this extra shit. Like, all I know is how to like record through my capture card or whatever. I was trying to like, you know, do like other things like be on YouTube with the capture card or whatever. I, cause I, I don't know how to do it. I really do not know how to do it. So I actually went out my way and went on the PlayStation and then whole t found out there's like no web browser on the playstation you got to do all this other extra bs so that's what i'm doing i'm i did all of that and i'm on youtube through here i'm going to play this video i got a no comment video no commentary video because the commentary they had commentary in a recent gameplay and it was literally a lot of talking so this is going to sound like a little choppy or whatever but like it's it's all gameplay you can pretty much deal with it and so i'm going to be pausing in and out because um yeah it's all interesting on my end so enough all all this talking let's do this see it says chapter five and so apparently i can't like um full screen it because you know it says my browser doesn't support it or whatever but you know yeah let me see if i can scroll up just a little bit yeah like that like don't this look really smooth like every time i get on youtube it's always somebody being a hater talking about this game looks like it's going to be garbage or whatever bro like y'all don't even give time for anything why y'all giving me ads <laughs> okay it's because i'm not using my actual thing that's why 
talking about some damn Hogwarts. I do not care about no Harry Potter or any of that. Never was a fan of that. Yeah, all y'all about to be like, what are you talking about, bro? Like, you don't like Harry Potter? I'm like, yes, I don't like Harry Potter. It's not that I don't like it. I just don't care about it. Along with Star Wars, too. If they give me what another ad, I'm just going to have to be doing all this cropping. But look at this. There's no... uh. You know, cutscene, cutscene phone call with Hunnigan and Leon. It's all like just strictly still in the game. Just like how they be talking to you in RE3. You know, when Carlos is talking to Jill through the walkie talkie and she can still move and stuff. But it's obviously going to disable like doing any actions until the phone call is over. So, yeah. That's the elegant headdress, the treasure. And so now they got side quests in this game. That's about to be so tough. I'm definitely about to be on it. I'm trying to like be up there when it comes to uh, bread in this game. Like I'm not going to be short when it comes to anything. I'm going to make sure I get what I need to get. My stealth is going to be like that, too. My stealth is definitely going to be like that. I think I won't blow it right here, wherever I get to this scene. Because he just alerted all of them. But there's definitely going to be ways. There's going to be tips, strats, speed run strats, all of that stuff. I'm going to learn it. They do move a really aggressive. So, is, they're not zombies, obviously. They're infected, so... I'm not going to have time to do certain things. I got to make sure I'm fully reloaded at all times. So, the flashbang still insta-kill. This is so smooth, man. This is so smooth. I dropped the green screen for you guys because I'm really lazy right now. I did not feel like doing all of that. But they're still going to have the little bird's nest. Hopefully, it's not just eggs inside the bird's nest. That's just what we've been seeing. Um, yeah, because in the bird's nest, you can find a grenade. You can find ammo. You can find treasure. You can find anything. Took care of a request. Well done. Look at you. Yeah, if you hear that, it's pretty much the edited audio that's out. Because the people playing this, they're like talking. So, you know, we don't need any of that. I'm just showing you guys the gameplay and it's my commentary. Because this is my channel and I'm Dirty Bandit and I does this. But he must have been stacking because how did he get that much bread? He has over 100k. So I wonder if like if I get like this deluxe edition, will I get extra bread or is this all getting it out from the mud? I mean, cuz yeah, he's in chapter he's in chapter 5 as it says. And so I just need to know I lost my train of thought for real, for real. This looks fire, like truly fire. But the one thing that's really blowing me, so it's like, I'm grateful for all of this footage, 
But the number one thing that's blowing me is they're not showing anything scary. Like, whatsoever. They have yet to show anything scary in whether a trailer or any of these gameplays. It's just pretty much all the action. I'm pretty sure that woman, her head just exploded into a plaga. The Ethan animations, the door animations. If I'm not mistaken, this could be the um, Chief Mendez's crib. Because I feel like I've seen this hallway and like the first trailer when they showed him like standing at the end of the hallway. That looks like the same hallway to me. Um, But they said, I'm, I'm listening to leakers and all that other stuff. But they said like the house was going to be like, you know, similar to like the Spencer, the Spencer Mansion. Or at least kind of like. Somebody said whether the Spencer Manson or um, the police department, the police, uh, the police department, the police station, RPD. And then look at that man. He already like just brought out the plugger just like that. Yeah, they're gonna be taking a lot more ammo. I think everything's gonna take a lot more ammo in this. The uh dogs, they're called like Comillos or something. Comilos. I don't speak Spanish, so you know, don't 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 hang me if I if I mispronounce it. But they took like two, not two shots. They definitely took like a few shots. Like it was less than five shots though. If you had like a handgun or if you had a shotgun, the shotgun like sat him down for real, for real. It's going to be taking some time to get used to since like, you know, it's uh, every time you go to another area and like it's a loading screen in Resident Evil 4. So this is all going to be like, you know, you go here, you go there. I wonder why Leon's so like, you know, hostile. They doing me dirty with them damn ads. I didn't log in, that's why. I actually should have logged in before playing this video. So they wouldn't hit me with these ads. But oh well. I'm actually really excited for this part right here. Because they haven't showed any of this. Well, not shown. They haven't done any of this in like, you know, the RE engine type. And yeah, they haven't done this. There's no co-op in these type of games for real, for unless they like, you know, put it in, you know, RE5 was the first with that, then six, but then they dropped it with like all the other stuff. I mean, like Revelations 2 has got the co-op and all that, but you know, they didn't have a moment in Resident Evil 2 remake where they had a scene like this. They didn't have a Claire and Leon scene doing something. There's not a scene in Resident Evil 3. It's, it's something like this. It's Carlos pretty much standing his ground, but like that's a whole different thing. Look at this though. This is fire. So when the plaga emerges, it's like you gotta do something to them. They look like they they take enough damage for real, for real. So it's like before you can kill them and then the plaga spawns, but I think you just gotta stun them and then the plaga spawns. That's what it looks like. I'm gonna be spamming a roundhouse kick though. Oh yeah, he split their wigs. And that that extra attack right there to like finish the job. Oh yeah. Hold up.
That drink said evade. So there's going to be a dodge mechanic too. I know they said parry, but that said evade. I did not see that before. They need to drop a boss bite. A boss bite. They need to drop a boss battle. A boss battle uh, clip. Whether Del Lago or El Gigante. That's tough though. They're adding a storage box in here. Thank goodness, bruh. So you don't have to sell your weapons. You don't have to sell your weapons if you have too much in inventory. That's it for that one. I'm going to go to this other one. So yeah. Watching all this gameplay. This is definitely at the beginning of the game, obviously. Like this one is literally giving straight uh, village vibes. At the very beginning, Ethan in the dark in a snowy place before he arrives in the village. This is literally giving this type of vibes. Ugh. This game is going for game of the year. I don't care. I'm saying it. I'm standing on it. This game is going for game of the year. I know for a fact. Anyone I'm home? Be happy for this game. The game is fun and easy. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be on it. But the the, the moment I see somebody hating on this game. I might have to press them. <laughs> might have to. Because there's no reason for this game to be getting hate and it hasn't even came out already. Like, I understand you're an OG fan of the original game, but, like, it's time for remakes, man. I mean, yeah, three, they kind of failed, but, like, you know, they won't do it again. You had faith in RE2, so support this one. Hey, hey. I'll just be saying stuff for real. I read you. What's your situation? <sighs> the hell's going on? I think right here is inedible work to get grabbed. Because how are you supposed to stop it? I mean, yeah, he took too long to shoot, but like, still. I mean, yeah, I could stealth it. But depending on how I got with ammo, if I know how to play this, I might play like the original game for real, for real. Pop the limbs, pop them on the leg, and you know, stun them, go up, roundhouse kick. And you know, they add that knife mechanic, so yeah, finish the job right after that. It should take, it should take no more than three bullets Rufus. doing that. This is Gondor 1. Hunting in here, what's your sit rep? President's daughter, Baby Eagle. Likely I'm building strats already. Right, we have a whole record. month and a half well, until this game drop. I'm dropping out and push stats. Strats. My escorts are. I hope that's an action too. Like, if it literally, if I stand by a window. And it gives me a command, and Leon just jumps out like that. I'm sold. And I'm 
gonna make sure for every video that I stream this, I'm gonna make sure I'm wearing the OG coat. The bomber jacket. I'm pretty sure that's not the dog. They might still surprise us with the dog. Apparently, that's supposed to be, you know, the dog that you save at the beginning of the game. But it might just be an extra. We might still come across him. not giving him the option to like take bro out so I think after a certain point in the story that's when the plugs will be you know something serious and you have to take them out oh, I come in running in the village she's not grabbing me I tell you that Definitely might do this. But I wonder if I actually go in this house, or no, if I don't go in this house, will uh, Dr. Salvador still, like, you know, be triggered? Because in the original, you can, like, literally go in that house across, shoot a hole in the door, and knife literally all the enemies walking up to the door. So the shotgun looks like it still sends people flying. I don't I didn't see anything what happened to her, but she got back though. I don't know if it took off her whole torso or whatever, but like she's gone. So he's still standing after that. You can stab him in the neck and they still want to be up there. They, it's just to get him off you. Oh, so just like an RE2 then. Like when they grab you and you use your knife or a flashbang or a grenade to like, you know, push them off you. But like, you still keep your knife and missile. Alright, yeah, it's going to repeat the footage. Um... I am truly excited for this game, like, no kids, I am really excited. I've been waiting on this game for some time now, and they keep dropping leaks, screenshots, gameplay, all this other stuff, and it's like, I don't really care about leaks and uh, gameplay, but it's just making me more eager to play the game, like, the more stuff I see and find out, it's just making me want the game even more, and, like, I don't like waiting. I really don't. I don't like waiting whatsoever. And March 24th can't come here any sooner. Like, I'm really excited for this game. It's about to be a game changer. Compared to the original Resident Evil 4, there's about to be so many game changes in this. They're not dropping, they're not dropping any content. Rather, they're going to be adding content. They're going to be getting scrap material from their old projects. The old original Resident Evil 4 uh, beta projects that they were doing. They're going to go all out with this game. I have high hopes and faith in this game that is going to be game of the year and that probably is going to overthrow um, the original game. It might. It might take the throne. 
and be the king of the best, you know, Resident Evil games because apparently RE4 is the best. It's not mine, in my opinion. I think my favorite, my favorite is definitely RE2 Remake. And, but RE4 is still great in this way because it's, it's the Godfather. It's pretty much, you know, it's the, uh, it's the blueprint for real, for real. But yeah, I am truly excited. Capcom, <laughs> I am truly excited. Like, I need y'all to like, you know, bless me with like something. I, I want to play this game. <laughs> I really want to play this game, Capcom. So like, if y'all could like, just bless me with a demo or something, give me exclusive access. I don't care, bro. Like, I need this. I need this game. And yeah. I don't even know how I'm about to end this for real for real but like I'm just steadily talking steadily saying hi positive things about this game because it's it deserves praise if anything I might get like a couple plays in like so obviously I'm streaming the whole story recording the whole story for you guys on the channel and then I'm gonna play right after I beat it I'm gonna boot up another game matter of fact there's a chance I might even start the game on a harder difficulty. So I might not start on standard. It depends. I may or may not, you know, it depends. Cause like I said, Resident Evil, they give you a couple of different uh, difficulties. Like RE3, there was like three extra hard modes. You had the easy mode or slash casual. I don't know what it was. You got standard and you had hardcore. Then you had like Nightmare, you had Nightmare and then Inferno, I believe. I feel like there's one more, but I'm not sure. If they do it with this, they could do easy, normal, slash standard. Um, they could do like a, a hard mode, like a regular hard mode. And then they could have the OG uh, professional mode like in the original one. Most likely, if they give me the second, you know, like another hard difficulty. So, I'm probably not going to do professional my first run. But I'll definitely do, like, the second hardest one, though. Like, the, the next best good one. Like, rather so the game won't be that cake to me. Um, everything's pretty much the same. It's just enemies are just stronger. They're just stronger. They take more to put down. So, it's going to be nothing, really. Um, I'm just literally thinking more to say. But I'm truly excited for this game, Resident Evil 4 Remake, Capcom, where I'm, I'm, I'm ready. I am ready. <laughs> I am ready for this game. Like, I haven't anticipated a game like this since, probably since Xenoverse 1 came out. When Dragon Ball Xenoverse 1 came out, like, you know, I was, like, on it. Like, I was on it, like, literally. School let out, and, like, I literally had to GameStop the day the game dropped and i was like yeah i need the day one edition all of that so i could get my super saiyan 4 vegeta all that like i haven't anticipated a game since then this was in 2015 we are now in 2023 resident evil 4 like i said we're on our way and we're coming we're coming pause if you guys enjoyed this little reaction video of our upcoming game resident evil 4 that we will be streaming on the channel you know throw your boy a like and if you're new, subscribe and throw some comments in. Pretty much, if you're excited as much as I am, also comment and subscribe and like all of that. And yeah, check out some of my other content too. I got other Resident Evil games on the channel. And yeah, until then, peace out and be safe, y'all.